Ganze. Hey guys, my name is Danielle Pottinger Cooper, but most of you know me as Jamaican Foodie Chronicles. I'm a food blogger as well as a digital marketer, and what I'm looking forward to the most for today's show is just me being able to fill up my belly and taste these amazing dishes. Hi everyone, I'm Katie Allen, digital marketer, events planner, and big, big, big foodie. I am so excited to be a part of the Rota Lifetime's cooking competition in the capacity of a judge. So, I can't wait to taste what Janelle and Matthew and their friends will be cooking up throughout the competition. This competition definitely will be hot and tasty. So, ensure that you watch every episode and cheer on your faves, okay? See you! Now that you know who the judges are, let's introduce our couples. Today we have, of course, the Williams and the Millers. Wow, wow. So excited to see you. <laughs> welcome, welcome. How was the trip getting here? We were off. Behind us, we're going 
Cheers first and then save or we save and then cheers. Cheers first. Alright, again, to good food and friends. And no running belly. And no running belly. Very important. So, teammates, how, what's going on? What are you doing right now? Talk well, to us. Well, I never, um, I never stopped as you can remember. You never, mm hmm. But I'm just taking instructions from the human in charge. Oh, from the actual chef. What's up, question? In this situation. And John, Matt, how is it going on over there? Um, well, I'm taking instructions from the chef in the relationship, okay. which is Matthew. So I'm just doing the prep work. So I was ordered to <coughs> cut up the seasoning for the chicken. So that's what I'm doing. Oh. I, am, I am the prep chef. You see that, guys? Marriage <laughs> equals collaboration. What you're beating out of the chicken is very good. I'm just trying to flatten it. Flatten it? More than it? Flat already? Yeah. Alright. I mean, you guys are the chef. Yeah. No, I'm just, I'm just learning. I'm just here to observe and all that. Did the chicken wash already do? No. Where is wash it? Vinegar or soap? <laughs> what if you say soap? <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> mm, you know what? We the use, we use vinegar. We use vinegar. <laughs> okay, alright. You don't want to taste anymore? Vinegar is a safe choice. Alrighty, here we go to, here we go to the top chef in the kitchen. Top chef, what are you doing over there? I'm talking about the teammates. Cutting up the seasoning. With them, how are you, so how are you doing with them around you? You know, professional. Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Chef's face. Chef's face. So let me ask you, do you think you're going to win? To be here. Yeah, and it smells cool coming from over Yes, here. so far so good. It smells great in here. Yep. Uh, well, whatever they're cooking, I'm looking forward to tasting. I'm looking forward to the flavors, the texture, and the presentation. I'm looking forward to see how they present what they're preparing. Yeah. So true. So true. <laughs> Well, I've been in the food business ever since I was born. <laughs> and I was a greedy child, so I heard. So no, yeah, yeah, no, it's not greedy. You're just passionate about the food. You're going to I've always that. been a passionate yes. lover of food. Yes. Right. So I've been in the food business since forever. And so I think that makes me a very ideal judge today. And I'm looking forward. To the food. I can't wait. You heard it here first. <laughs> Looking forward to the food. Hey Daniel. Hi Gigi. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm really excited to see what the couples are gonna prepare for us today. They're killing it. I'm really hoping that the food is properly cooked. <laughs> that we will not be getting sick because it's been only 45 minutes that they have and I'm just so excited. 
I am also excited and of course you heard or or other hosts tell you that we're not going to be tasting the food. I'm so sorry for you guys. But you know, if it doesn't work out, then that would be better That would be for better. You guys. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so, Jamaica knows you as Jamaican Foodie. Chronicle, so tell me about yes. it. Jamaican Foodie Chronicles. Okay, tell me about so it. it's a blog I started about three years ago. Mm -hmm. um, just going around Jamaica and just featuring the different restaurants that we have. Because you know that Jamaica is just a big melting pot of it really is. great food. Yes. And so one of my favorite points of my blog is mm -hmm. that I have foodie guides. Yeah. Cause you know, sometimes you want to go out, but you don't know where to go. Yeah. So that's the feature of my foodie guides that, you know, when you go on my blog, you can just look through different um, sections of the guides. Mm -hmm. So whether you're feeling for uh, like some vegetarian food, if you're looking for something sweet, yeah. each guide is sectioned and then you'll be able to just go through and see what kind of food that you want to eat, whatever it may be. That is absolutely amazing. So tell me like, I mean, where have you gone that you wouldn't think that most Jamaicans have been? Like what's the most crazy type of food that you've okay, ever had? Okay, probably not crazy type of food, but mm -hmm. I really enjoy going to restaurants that feature just more than the ordinary fried chicken and curry yeah food. so you know you have Shea Maria which is a Lemonese and Italian restaurant it's amazing you know I love barbecue as well so I love going to rib cage and mm -hmm. eating all the ribs and then you have Opa which is a Greek restaurant located yeah. in Devon House so I just love to enjoy <laughs> other cultures and featuring their dishes so I hear what you're saying and obviously you're telling me that you're the go-to girl like Jamaican <laughs> Food Chronicles is I'm the go-to to <laughs> no girl we're gonna claim it and okay. name it you're the go-to go so to. we know that there have been a couple new restaurants on the scene so tell us like what we should look forward to okay so you guys should be looking forward to on my blog um new features with some of the new restaurants that are here um, I'm trying my best to reach out to brands as well and All right. brand collaborations. Expansion. You'll see a recent one with Juicy Patties. It was absolutely amazing. And I just can't wait to show you guys what else I have in store. All right. Thank you so much, Daniel. <laughs> OMG. I hope you guys have a grand time today. Thank you. So as we close out this section, we're just going to head back over to see what they're doing over there because as we know, time is running out and we really hope that them chicken are cook. Are you guys like uber focused or do you guys like sing? Sing with dance. Sure. 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 Sure.
I'm great. I'm just ready to taste the food here. Yes. People of Jamaica, off, scene, off camera, they've been critiquing. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Nervous. <laughs> Nervous. So it's the thing? moment that we've all been waiting for. Yummy, yummy, yummy. <laughs> and I want you guys to be as descriptive as possible because we're not tasting the food. Sure. Because you know, they might say we have biases and then so okay. so be descriptive and be be critical, be crucial, tear it up, literally. And wow. let us know how it come out. So okay. before you guys start tasting, mm -hmm. tell me like what are you guys judging them based on? Okay, so we're judging based on taste, probably. Um, and the presentation, yeah, my team, my team, my team. And taste and presentation right now. And mm -hmm. the texture is important as well. And so we're looking for all that. Definitely, and if it's well cooked, yes. Of course, my team is really. Which team are you on? Wait, don't show us. Oh, right. Oh, that's us. Don't show us. I'm just saying, my team is really. Okay, okay, okay. She has been manifesting that all episode and I'm going to see. I know what this song, it goes name it, claim it, some name and it's a So guess you know what? what? We're going to allow you guys to okay. taste it and let us know. Okay, you want so to we're starting with. Do you want to start with? Okay. Oh, that one? This is here. Okay, so I'll start with that one. Okay, this is the, the Williams' um, stuffed breast. Okay, yes. stuffed breast. Mm. Okay, so from just the first glance, how do you guys, is it well cooked? Is that the first thing? We know. have to taste it's it to find it out, but it looks good. Alright, let's okay. check it out. Alright, intensity. Fingers crossed. Let's go the other way. Oh, okay. And a knife. Okay. <laughs> There's a knife. Yeah, the knife seems a bit dull. Because it's not supposed to go on the Let's start here. Let's start with this one. This side. Yeah, both are really good. One. No, the judges don't say that. 
Listen, the fact that she said it's a hard decision to make, and just like right after she never went, no, mm, 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 she said it's amazing. Did she say that? Let's roll back the clip. <laughs> <laughs> it's called inference. Okay, what do you think, Kiryan? It's a lucky thing that we made Gianna host and not judge. <laughs> Well, let me start by saying again, it seems as if the millers they used all the ingredients, and I like that the chicken is well stuffed, there's color in there, the flavors are amazing, and um, the color is a tad bit undercooked for me, but that's fine. Um, it's also full of flavor and I like that. So kudos to the Miller and presentation is on yes, 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 So I yes, love that yes, as well. Yes. I love that you use a lot of cheese. Yeah. <laughs> and the crowd goes wild. The Miller is the so amazing. <laughs> Let's hear what Daniel has to say. Um, I'm thinking the same thing as you, Kida. Um, I'm my favorite aspect of this dish is the chicken with the cheese is the mm -hmm. for me but I do enjoy the kalaloo and the cheese more from the other couple right. as well mm -hmm. so it's gonna be a tough decision you guys want some time to yes yes we're gonna need some time Congrats to the Millers and big up to the Williams. You really fought, you know, what yeah. you fight, where you fight, say, tooth and nail. Or sorry, what? Yeah. They fought to the tooth and the nail of it all. So, congratulations, everybody. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching this episode, guys. And we'll I hope you. that you guys enjoyed it. And, and we'll see you next week. Um, yeah, what after the one, two, three? Yeah. One, two, three. We'll, we'll see, see you next week. week.